Right, you're Auburn women's basketball coach, Terry Williams, Illinois. And coach, I know you talked to the team about four parts of the season, you're entering the third part. So first is how do you feel about the team going into this third part of the season, the SEC schedule? Well, I think anytime you can go in at, um, what are we, 11 and two? <laughs> 11 and two, it has definitely given our kids um, a chance to feel confident um, we've been in some tough games, you know, so it gives them a chance to understand that, you know, how to play a little harder, how to win from being down, how to hold on to leads, you know. So we, we've been in a lot of games to help us prepare and get ready. Is the competition in the SEC tougher? Of course, but when you have a, a mental confident about yourself, you know, it just makes it, feels a lot, make it feel a lot better. You talked about the mental confidence, and for this, for every player on the team, this is the most wins they've ever had going into league play. So how, what are you seeing in them from a confidence level, and how are they feeling just in general going into league play? Um, I think they're feeling pretty confident. You know, the practices are the same. They're still tough, <laughs> you know. from Sometimes they probably feel like they don't ever do anything right. Um, but that's just our way of just letting them know, you know, you know, yeah, we're 11 and two, but we can't get complacent. You know, we got a tough conference in front of us. You know, we we got to be ready. There's been a lot of firsts this season. You know, first time for this in 20 years, and four years, and five years, and most recently, there's Najet with her game against uh, Samford. And just talk about what she was able to do. You know, to steal away from a triple double and doing a few things that haven't been done in a long time. Yeah, you know, the biggest thing with Najet is just getting her to play under control. I, mean, I think Jess is a very good player. Um, you know, does her size hold her back sometimes? Yeah, it does. But she just plays with so much heart and, and just plays hard all the time, you know. And sometimes that gets her in trouble doing things that she probably, her size doesn't allow her to do. Um, but for Jet, that's, that's pretty a, a normal game when you think about how hard she really plays. And moving into league play, starting off with nationally ranked Arkansas team, just talk a little bit about what you've seen out of Arkansas. Yeah, Arkansas is a really good team. I mean, you know, it's a couple of things we got to be able to defend. You know, you know, they said, you know, a million ball screens. You know, it's kind of like the NBA, which, you know, ball screens are hard to defend, you know, especially when they got some really good players that can either shoot the three off of the ball screens or penetrate to the basket. Um, you know, they got Sarah Watkins coming off of the bench, you know, who's, you know, a true starter. Um, so that they're they're playing really well right now, and they're they're a tough matchup for us for our first SEC game. In particular, is there one thing you see with Arkansas? You're like, like man, that that's tough, or one player that you're seeing that's really fueling them to this good start? Well, I mean, I think you know, four is always Sarah's tough. Um, you know, number one, you know me and my numbers. You know, number one, she's she's tough. She's hard to guard off the balance, and she she plays with such a high energy and a high motor. She's just a kid that's just always around. She's crashing in for the offensive boards. You know, those two kids are. You know, when you think about the go-to players, those are the two kids that have really been, you know, the spark for for Arkansas, helping them to to lead um, and get to where they are. But then they just have so many other pieces together. You know, the point guard is steady. You know, she runs the team. They're, they're just a really good, you know, all-around basketball team. And this isn't the first time you've seen a Tom Collin coach team. You saw him at Louisville your first couple of years at Georgetown. Is, is, uh, does this team kind of fall in with what you remember there? Or how, how is it facing him again in another league? Yeah, uh, Tom always running in ball screens. He, <laughs> you know, which, which, you know, everybody has a style of play, and that's his, his style of play offensively. Um, just like our style of play is, is pressing. So, yeah, we, we've seen it before. <laughs> All right, thanks, Coach. Thank you.